Welcome to Age Fit with Tess. My name is Tess, physiotherapist. By the end of this video, you are going to know how to complete a routine of exercises to help with scapular winging, shoulder pain, and upper back posture. This is my personal favorite exercise of all time. Make sure to join the Age Fit with Tess Facebook group to get further support with staying fit and active. Let's get started. The first four variations are strength focused before we move on to dynamic control. Start by lying on your stomach with your arms by your side. Lift your hands off the ground and lower down. Repeat six times. Scapular winging occurs when the scapula or shoulder blades do not sit flush on the rib cage. Moving on to the second variation, bring your arms away from your body roughly 45 degrees. Again, lift your hands off the ground. Building strength and control of the serratus anterior and other scapular supporting muscles can improve scapular winging and also symptoms related to shoulder impingement, bursitis, tendinopathy, rounded shoulders or poor posture. For the third variation, continue to bring your arms away from your body toward your head, just above shoulder height. Again, lift your hands off the ground, repeating six times. Given the number of benefits for the shoulders and back, this exercise routine is my personal favorite warm up before any upper body workout. For the fourth variation, reach your hands out in front of you alongside your head. Again, lift your hands up off the ground, repeating six times. My recommendation with using this routine as a warm up is to pick one or two variations to complete rather than the entire routine. The fifth variation incorporates dynamic control and is typically a progression of the previous variations. With your hands by your side, reach above your head and then back by your sides, keeping your arms up from the ground throughout. This exercise is known as angel wings or butterflies. If you struggle to lay on your stomach, make sure to check out the linked video above for a seated alternative to this routine. The sixth variation includes the addition of weights. Start with light weights such as half a kilo as this can be a challenging exercise to complete with weights. Remember to join the Age Fit with Tess Facebook group to get further support with staying fit and active. Make sure to subscribe and ring the bell for the next video. To continue to stay fit and active in the meantime, watch these two videos right here. See you next time.